Well, we're privileged here tonight, Alexandra Park, to have the Chief Executive Officer from Gloucester Park in Perth. Mate, you must be wrapped, Michael Radley, with the Dominion announcement. Yeah, it's, uh, it's taken, a, taken a while to, to pull together, but um, yeah, really happy, and uh, I think it's exciting for harness racing that uh, uh, what we can do with uh, the Inter Dominion, but uh, the world's richest, richest pacing race, which is really good for, for Australasia, and we're hoping as, as many New Zealand horses get there as possible. So uh, I think it's great for Australasia harness racing. And you'll be going down to the Cup uh, next week to maybe scout a few horses? Yeah, we've, uh, we've already spoken to uh, Queen Dalgetty, obviously. You come over for our launch and a few others. But, uh, yeah, we just want to make sure that uh, all the trainers know when it's on and, and going back to the traditional format of three heats and a final and nomination times and, and, and things like that. So, so they really know. And we're also going to try and uh, make sure that it's going to be as easy as possible for horses from both the eastern states of Australia and New Zealand that are, are going to be able to get to um, Perth for, um, for the Indian because that's probably our biggest obstacle, how far the, the territory of distance. So if we can sort of close that gap and uh, make it uh, as easy as possible for horses to get there, you know, we, we'd hope to see you know, at least half a dozen horses from New Zealand come over. I hope so, mate. I remember the last time you hit the Inter Dominions over there. Wasn't that a great it, it certainly was, and, and the Kiwis played a, a really big part of that. Um, Auckland Reactor went fantastic, and, and Raglan for, for the Butts were fantastic as well. And, and, and the Butts have got a fantastic record over in Perth. They, they love going, Tim and Anthony, so hopefully they can get a horse for it. But uh, no, it, it, we, we love uh, having the, 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 the New Zealanders over there, and um, you know, it's, it's a really exciting time for, for harness racing, as I said. And, and I think it's going to add a bit of fluidity to the, the feature race calendar as well for, for Australia and New Zealand, so it's not disjointed and, and races here and there. I think there's going to be a bit, of a, a bit more of a flow as well, which is, I think, going to be better for everyone. No Quinny this, this time, mate, but he no. might, might show up as, as a, maybe a guest. Yeah, well, it, yeah, sad news that he's, he's been retired. Um, he certainly was uh, very good for us. Every time he, he came, you know, a couple of thousand people would turn up and see him, and he's been such a wonderful horse, and I'm glad that um, New Zealand got to see him. He won a couple of Auckland Cups, and of course, uh, end up being declared the winner of the Inter Dominion over here, but um, it, yeah, he's a wonderful horse and uh, we'll probably do something for him and we might even see if he can leave the pacing cup field out, but we'll definitely have him as part of the Inter Dominion, that's for sure. And uh, Yeah, he's been a wonderful ambassador for harness racing in WA and, and so is, so is the, the, the horse stable, they're, they're wonderful and uh, everything we ask them to do, whether we, we get Quinny to turn up to different things, they're the first to say, yep, no problems, when do we need us? And, and that's great for harness racing because we need uh, those sort of ambassadors and, and, and horses that really capture the imagination like Quinny because he's, he just had such a sensational racing style of, of giving every run a start and, and rounding them up and, and I think I think that's why he's so popular. Mate, your fantastic horse was part of the furniture over there. Have you heard from the connections of Bowtide? Would, would he be coming? Uh, yeah, James Ratray. Um, I haven't spoken to him directly, but um, a, a board member's uh, friends with, with those or a, a couple of in the stable. So, um, look, we'd be hoping for a horse like Bowtie to come across, and um, great, great to see him jump back to the winners list the other week at Menangle. And he's certainly probably the heir apparent to Quinny as far as the, Australia's best horse. So, look, we'd love to see him over there. And I think I think there's a bit of a transition period coming through now. Um, Quinny's when he's gone, smoking up's gone, so you need horses like Bowtide uh, coming through, and, and I suppose in New Zealand you've got the same sort of thing with um, Kara Love's been at the top for so long, and I, you know we don't know how long much longer he's going to be there. He keeps on going on, so uh, he's going to be favourite again on Tuesday. But um, you know, it'd be great to see the next lot come through um, with Chris and me and those type of horses. So you know, we're, we're looking for that next generation of paces to sort of really stand up and stamp the authority because the the, the mantle of um, the best, the best patient in Australia is certainly there to be taken. Well, Michael, it's, it's a pleasure to have you here tonight, mate. I'll see you in Christchurch next week. I'm going to put you on the, on the spot. Yep. What's your quinella for the New Zealand Cup? Yeah, look, uh, look, I've, I've, Luke McCarthy's a very good friend of mine, so I'm going to go with for a reason. Uh, he's a, I, I love the horse for a reason. He's, he's had a, a lot of injury issues and he's battled through, and there's not a better horseman going around than, than Luke McCarthy. So, look, I, I might go for my two mates if that's possible. I, it's, it's more of a heart than, a, than, a, than through my kicks. So I'll go, um, I'll go Luke McCarthy with uh, for a reason, and Chris and me with for um, Cran and Dexter. So, Cran's a, a great supporter of ours, and uh, I'm a big fan of Chris and me. So, I've left out. Terror to love. I do it in my own peril, but uh, we'll go with uh, for a reason to beat Terry, uh, to beat uh, Chris and me. You heard it first live here on Alexander Park TV. Pleasure, Michael Randy. Absolute pleasure. Good. Thank, Thank you. you.